Thanks. Free beer and hot wings in the morning. Grand Rapids rocks all day. 97.9 GRD rocks. Mostly cloudy and cool. 50 the high. 41. Now, reminder, Jana at the Goey Center right now until noon. Teamed up with Google helping businesses find, uh, helping Google help businesses help people find their business easier. That is a lot of help. Man, yeah. we should have done her Circle. first remote break right now. Circle of life. Uh, she'll join she us in a called little bit. In. She'll be in a little bit. Fine. Be in now. We could have done crosstalk. We could yeah. have done some sweet crosstalk. What's <laughs> up, girl? Uh, Joe. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what's up, girl? Uh, Joe gave us uh, the headline on this, but there's more to it. The Tulip Time Festival for 2018. Headlining entertainment and more. Yeah. Now. We love our apples, and yeah. in Holland, of course, they love their tulips. With the rainy weather, we've had a perfect time to look forward to tulip time in 2018. Yeah, we might be more than six months away, but the festival just made some exciting Let's announcements. Dance, look so mad while he's talking celebration. about this. He's he's he has he a look very serious look on wow, his face. he does. He looks uh, just grim at somebody. We that, need and to, that's the, not his personality. The, he is a the, very happy man. These right. are the our cameraman has clearly just made some offhanded remark. Well, maybe he wanted to talk about apples more, but they ran out of time. He's like, yeah, we all we all really love our apples, but, you know, some people like yeah, tulips. Yeah, too, tulips don't even happen until the spring. Yeah. Apples are now. Yeah, apples are him. what's happening. Hey, yeah. Dan, why so serious? No, man? we have yeah. to take a screenshot, send it to guard, and this is what we're talking about secretly tomorrow. No yeah. one tell Dan that we yes. want to talk about his angry face. Yes, because he's asleep by now. Yeah. tell Give him a totally false subject. Yep. Until and the then teleprompter we put up this starts rolling. Say, Why so serious? Yes. Red is here to tell us what those announcements are. So exciting. So that's right. We now know the entertainment lineup for the event. And who better to headline than a group that's provided, we'll say, the soundtrack for summer for over five decades. Now, the Beach Boys are going to be the ones he headlining. The group has accomplished a lot over the years. They were inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 1988. That's not and the Beach the Boys. That's Beach Boy and guys. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Is Stamos going to be there? Uh, yeah, that's him on the left. He shows up sometimes. <laughs> I mean, it really is. Which it's Beach Boy? Mike Love. Yeah. Well, that's pretty good. The guy right in the, the middle. Like uh, Al Jardine tours with Brian Wilson at this point. Yeah, as the Beach Boys as well. No, because they no, no. still. Because mm. I think they no, still. They, if they ever record music together, I think they still do it together. But the Beach Boys touring band, yeah, is well, Mike they, Love. They reunited, and then at some point on the tour, Mike Love, who apparently has some ownership of the whole thing, went, "Yeah, why don't you two guys sit a few plays out? I'll go on tour with the other guys." Really? Yeah. Oh, there's some there's some issues there. Well, mm -hmm. yeah, you're right. This is Beach Boy. It'd still be good, though. I think it'd still Grammy, be great. Probably. Along with many more accomplishments, of course. Okay. Oh, the Texas Tenors. Look at that what? suave don't... band of boys. <laughs> what <laughs> are they? Vampires? I don't know. <laughs> I know, right? Okay, the guy, uh, <laughs> it's hard to explain, but uh, I That's guess not a real I, I assume this is, uh, <laughs> these guys are like Tex-Mex uh, opera singers. We have to hear I mean, if they're the Texas them. Tenors. Okay. And one guy has what appears to be a legitimate goatee. The other guy appears to have a goatee that's been photoshopped on. <laughs> it looks like he glues where, it on. Where it was just like, okay, we need some brown hair. What do we get it from? Get a picture of a monkey <laughs> and uh, just steal his fur and stick it to uh, stick it to Juan's face. Or God, that guy definitely looks like someone who would try to hypnotize old people, pretending he's a magician yes, late at he night, would. and then old people send him checks, but they don't know why. These guys look ridiculous. Ridiculously stupid. Now, well, the guy might, in they front might looks be great. really handsome. But I want to hear them. I do too. I'll probably love it. I right. know. Uh, well, after okay. the video, yeah, yeah. Let's, no, I want to hear. Just keep going. That guy is unnerving with his uh, unnatural yeah. facial hair. <laughs> yeah, the guy on the right is very handsome. The guy in the middle is quite handsome too. Yeah. Looks like he could play Flash Gordon. Yeah, the guy in the middle yeah. looks like Owen Wilson if he didn't have a bent penis nose. He looks right. like Zac Efron with old Bieber hair. Yes. Okay. Tickets, tickets for that show start at $65 a person. More national entertainment includes the new Odyssey Dinner Show, the Texas Tenors, Fiddle Fire, and the Liverpool Legends. The Liverpool well, Legends, I will say this. I don't know if they sound like a great Beatles tribute band, 
But they sure look like one. Yeah. Uh, a couple a- of those guys look like the spitting image of them. They're actually a monkey's cover band. <laughs> wow, that is weird. <laughs> that is so odd. Uh, they open for Last Train <laughs> to Clarksville. They only play Jerry and the Pacemakers music. Before we go on, yes, we will allow you to take some time to start Googling Fiddle Fire because well, oh, I know yeah. that you want to. And I am it's going killing to. You. I thought they said Fiddle Fuddle. So I'm glad you said that. Fiddle Fire. Fiddle Faddle's candy. Fiddle Fire. You should take, Steve, you could take your then wife, Annette. It's true. See some fiddle experts. Uh huh. Ooh. What is this? When's tulip time? April. Yeah. I'm there. Buy my tickets now. Uh, fiddle they Fire. Just, uh, fiddle Fire just released 25 years of the CDB. Mm. Is that great? A Charlie disease? Daniels Band. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. That's great. Well, you know that. Okie dokie. Mm hmm. There's going to be plenty of. Uh, to do, excuse me, besides those shows, a list of culinary events, art and culture performances. Sweeping. There's a, a lot of different things <laughs> happening at the Knickerbocker as well. Mm-hmm. All of those um, are going to be listed on our website. Another cool thing, a Michigan musician who made it to as a finalist on the show The Voice, Joshua Davis, uh, mm-hmm. he's planned to perform as well. So a lot who? of fun stuff him? going on. And like I said, a full <laughs> list of those performances on our website right now, WZZM13.com. Tulip Time runs from May 5th through May 13th. Can't wait for May. <laughs> right <laughs> around <laughs> April is what we <laughs> meant. Like uh, sometime. Uh, sometime. Hang on, Dan's about to say something angry. <laughs> he, yeah. did, um, he, he did. Like, <laughs> you couldn't see him on the camera the whole time Camity was talking from Channel 13. And then when they went back, he still looked a little sour. Yeah, he's about to, yeah. Something. Before then, but the Beach Boys. That's got to be one of the biggest names I've ever had at, at Tulip Time, so that's pretty cool. They it's really? <laughs> He's still wow. What? Confused. I swear. I know. What? That was probably... He I looks like he really story. wants to say favorite. something, and he's holding <laughs> back. He is. There's a lot of yippy yappy <laughs> going on. Winner, he wants yeah. to say what okay. we said. He <laughs> wants to say cool that the t- Texas Tenors look like three dildos with <laughs> <laughs> two of them <laughs> with <laughs> goatees. Yeah. And one looks like a fake goatee. All right, let's hear the Texas Tenors. Turn you have up. it? I got some of that. Okay. Yeah. They Can you do, imagine they if they do if covers? They, it's opera with the F word. Oh, my God. That'd be great. They do covers? Yeah. Of what, three tenors or... This flag still stands for freedom. Oh my god, this is so gay. Can't take this is blowing my away. mind. Oh, the lovers? And I'm proud to be an American Where at least I know I'm free This could okay, be us. We know so what they that do. song sounds like. How did they make a less soulful version than the original? Know. I don't know. Oh, look at this. I'm sorry, that guy's not a tenor. Still He's an alto. He's a woman. <laughs> ah, oh, is this Spanish? There's nothing Texas about this. No. Their outfits are pretty Texas. No, that's all it is. It's not. three guys. All right, let's see. Let's see what they sound like when they do some Alabama. Isn't this Alabama? Play some mountain music. Yeah. I mean, it's not um, that they're terrible at having a harmony. It's just that there's, boy, everybody man, are they soulless. Start buying your roofies detecting straws right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is gross. Yeah. <laughs> Who uh, are these guys? Let's look back and at why did of... they ruin okay, so much? What was that other uh, band you what? talked about? Fiddle Fiddle, fiddle Fupa. <laughs> no, fiddle what? I typed that in. Fiddle Fire. Fire. It's just a fiddle cover of This is going to be good. Songs. Okay, well, they're going to be good. I mean, if they're... Uh, it's one man. Because they're a dedicated cover band. And usually those types of bands are really good because they're singularly focused. All right. Yeah, it's... Just make you wet, Steve. I love this song. See, this, would, this is good. Can Annette play that? On her fiddle? I bet she No, could. I think we talked about oh, this. Oh, she's got to learn that. That would be given her a one year ass. deadline to learn it. <laughs> well, it would be so awesome. That, it would be neat if she could do that at the wedding. Is, okay. And then you could sing it. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be neat. It would be neat.
Devil went down to Georgia. He's mm-hmm. looking for a soul to see. Yeah, he was in a like bind. He was way behind. Hike and up her, her wedding dress a bit and tap her foot. Oh, yes. for sure. God, that would be sexy. Uh, yeah. You know, Steve, uh, I, I better feel if like, you did it. I, I don't like know why since, you need to like, objectify so her when I she's have playing to put rock on and roll. A dress to do it. Uh, oh, yeah. Dude. Steve, I yes. feel like since you decided, since you got engaged, we have planned like the biggest ball of a wedding. That anyone's ever heard of, yeah. and I don't feel like you're going to lo- use a I'm, lot of these no, 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 I feel like it's going to be a keep, boring wedding turd. I'm keep urinating on everything. Boring wedding turd. I'm still waiting for uh, your your song suggestions. Well, mine is that one played by you. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, what would be really awesome if she, she did the fiddle and then you learned the electric guitar because the devil has that electric guitar. Oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah, you got to do that part. Uh, do you guys remember these performers who appeared as the headliners? No, nobody does. I don't even know who you're going to say. <laughs> you're, you're, gonna know all, you're, you're wrong. Okay. Headli- former headliners at Tulip Town. In 2000. <laughs> Tulip Town. Tulip Town. Tulip Town. <laughs> yeah, that's like Toontown. Yeah. Uh, Tulip Town. Tulip Town. Something you can find on Punish Tube. It's not what you think. <laughs> <laughs> Careful Googling Tulip Town. <laughs> yeah. Two with uh, a W. Yeah. Oh. Mm, uh, yeah. 2000. Christina Aguilera. <laughs> 2001, O-Town. Great. 2006, O-Town. Frankie oh, Avalon, the Oak Ridge Boys, okay, and Jars of Clay. Wait, the Oak Ridge, isn't that the band that you want to join? The no. Oak? No, that's, no, uh, that, no, no, that's watch that. your mouth. That's no, like their the, rival. The Oak Ridge Boys are uh, way cooler. Who is it? Uh, wrong. They are like a he poverty wants to knockoff. Join the Statler brothers. Yeah, Statler and they've brothers. been retired that's for right, more no. than a decade. Oak Ridge Boys, so, come on, man. They're the ones who went... Um, bop, mo, mo, yeah. That's a parlor trick. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> Joe, do you still have your giddy contact up. at the Statler Museum? Uh, I do. That's I not a contact. absolutely do. It is a contact. I called. Yeah, you might as well call the Smithsonian. I believe I left a message. It's a uh, real thing. In, you told me about it. In, two th- <laughs> in 2007, Bruce Hornsby. Nice. 2008, this is quite a combo. Now, they weren't playing together, but it's still wild. Uh, Johnny Lang, Tony Orlando, Ronnie Millsap. Oh, mm. Johnny from Lang the is awesome. <laughs> yes, God, Ronnie great. from the glasses. Yes, <laughs> the guy. Yeah. Uh, 2009, Jan Mulder uh, from uh, the X Files. 1964, uh, The Tribute. Bobby Vinton, and back once again, the Oak Ridge Boys. Okay. Boy, that was uh, a I great year for yeah. that was pop them Okay, now these now. are all headliners for Tulip Time in the past. The Coasters, 2010. The Drifters, the Platters. Oh man, it was a full-on doo-wop night. That Starship. is sweet. That's cool. Starship. Oh, Mickey Thomas. Black. And <laughs> Blackwater CEO Eric Prince. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> I don't think he performed. He didn't like shoot an Afghani or anything. What did he do? Well, yeah, yeah, but what? Collect what money. What did he do? <laughs> I, he was like the like. Did he come in on a Black Hawk helicopter? He had. He had, he had a seminar. Ah, uh, well, uh, 2014. Okay. Now, before they hear, before they entertain you with their dulcet tones <laughs> and sing Charlie Brown, uh, I'm here to tell you about how to kill people. <laughs> <laughs> now the coasters. <laughs> uh, 2014, the headliner for Tulip Time. Pop Evil. No. Almost. They like to be known as Peevil now. By the way. Really? Yeah. And then it was like 2015 when well, everything well, went crazy. Maybe if you uh, still have boy. those straws uh, from that time, oh, yeah, you probably you don't still have, have to buy new ones. Boxes probably can afford them. Justin gets Starship's biggest hit out. Mm-hmm. We're gonna have to hear that since it was mentioned. Yeah. Now don't make the mistake of going too far back and looking up Jefferson Starship or Bo- Jefferson Airplane. Airplane. God yeah. forbid it's when just they were a rock Starship? band. Yeah. 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 Just Starship. Yeah. yeah. If need... Mickey Thomas wasn't in it, you don't want it. We need to hear the sounds of the future in space. Oh uh, yeah. All right. Oh, uh, wings. I know what you think of when you hear Mickey Thomas because it's. The same I think thing of I his think birthday. Of. Yep. Mm-hmm. We had this comedian yeah. in named John Joseph one time who he he could just make us make up a dumb song about anything. So I handed him. Yeah. The on this date in history. Yeah. And he took it and then he started playing. He went, Mickey Thomas's, Thomas's birthday, birthday from Jefferson Starship. He, he says was, he's 49, but he's lying. He's and been 49 since I was 17, 17 years old. Wow. Yeah. I've See, that Roland sounded Hill great. invented the first mm. p- adhesive postage stamp, but nobody really gives, gives a, a damn. damn. 
Is this guy still on this this paper? paper? I I don't know. know. Is this guy still alive? I'd love to hear him do this stuff. Yeah. He was great. He was was fantastic. I mean, he would just, yeah, we'd just give him a sheet of anything and he'd just turn it into a song. We went good. We went and uh, saw him that night. John John Joseph. And um, you know how you talked about with Jimmy Pardo? Yeah. He did like, uh, he'd do an hour and then you'd go, I don't think he did any material. Yeah. That's exactly how this John Joseph was. It was pretty great. Where is he now? I might have that. He's I wonder if I be, have that. Huh? If you have it, I'd old. love to hear it because you, you two guys made it sound good. I assume well, it, that the it sounds The fact that it's great. been stuck in my head for all this time. Mm, I don't think I do. Seventeen, fourteen, John, something discovered Uranus, Uranus before, before then. People pooped through their noses. <laughs> Thank God for Flamstein. <laughs> John Flamstein, that's what it was. For we had poo-poo all day long. We so no, we smelled poo-poo all day smell long. Poo-poo all day long. <laughs> okay. Thank for God for reason. Flamstein. Before then, we smelled poo-poo all day long. <laughs> for some reason. If somebody's just tuning in. They're like, those guys are definitely high. They have, uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Without that's been question. 20 years, and remember, we remember every word. Mm-hmm. If this guy, he should be a, a song tutor. he played one time. He should be like... Man, I, I should offer I don't services. have that on here. I know we have it on some CD somewhere. All right. I do. Well, yeah, I do. <laughs> All right. That's enough. All right. That's enough. That's oh, we didn't 20. hear Starship. Yes, we have. Can you put it in the We built this up? city. <laughs> Jen, I'll play I'm that in 10. Roll. Oh, they make her now. It's Bush, Machine Head, 97.9 GRD Rock.